Hey everybody, this is CapNex24 bringing you another part of the Pokemon Heart Gold and Soul Silver Gotta Catch Em All walkthrough. Now, as you can clearly see, we're in New Bark Town. The reason is the egg we got hatched into a Togepi, and uh, shortly afterwards, Professor Ellen will give you a call saying, Hey, uh, I heard the egg hatched. Don't know how he heard, but anyway, he wants you to show it to him. And uh, put it as first in your party. There we go. And talk to him. And then he'll uh, just go on about something. And then he'll give you an item. This item's not incredibly useful. It's called the Everstone. It explains what it does. What it does is um, it's a held item. And if you give it that, it like won't evolve. It's not exactly the world's most useful thing. But it's worth showing off. So now, back over to Union Cave, that area. Alright, so here we are in the Pokemon Center. And actually talk to this guy here. Tell him you're picking Apricorns. And, um, he'll give you two Lure Balls. And I forgot what they do. They're a type of Pokeballs. And, um, alright. He just said it makes it easier to catch Pokemon that appear when you go fishing. He tells you to go find a guy called Kurt by Azalea Town. And, um... He'll show you like what you can do with Apricorns. Also, go over here and if you rock smash this, there'll be an item there. It's a Shell Bell. It's a held item. In fact, I'm going to actually give it to one of my Pokemon. Let's see. Who should I give it to? Probably should give it to... Well, Totodile's my main Pokemon, so... Yeah. Also, Metapod here evolved into a Butterfree and learned Confusion. Anyway, here we are in Union Cave. If you go over here, there's an item right off the bat. It's an X attack. Can actually be very useful. And uh, there are a bunch of enemies here. Just a Geodude. Alright, so now go over here. And this, I think, is actually optional. If you go up to this guy, it looks a little bit strange. This guy, all he has is a level 9 Vulpix, I think. He's Fire Breather Ray. There we go. Called it. And Totodile, actually, like any water type, will tear this stuff up. Like, uh, on Heart Gold, I got myself a Wooper. And that's been doing pretty well. I mean, I'm not even, like, all the way through Union Cave on Heart Gold yet, and it's already gotten, like, two level ups. Because Water Gun destroys pretty much everything you'll face in here. There we go. Totodile gets some experience. And Simple Battle was over pretty much right when it started. If you go down here, I believe this is optional. First go up here. Alright, in that battle, Totodile leveled up. And here we get an X-Defend. It tried to learn Scary Face, but I decided to keep Leer. Go over this way. And over here we find another item. This one is the uh, TM-39 Rock Tomb. Not that bad. And uh, now we can leave here, because there's really nothing else we can do. And now go down this way. There's this trainer here. Let's see, this guy, I think he only has one Pokemon. This is Hiker Daniel. Yeah, only one Pokemon. It's an Onyx. Level 11, but Totodile's Water Gun will tear this up. So we shouldn't have any problems. There we go. I doubt it'll survive. Dead. Nice. Got a bunch of experience. And Totodile levels up. Level 16. There we go. Get a good bit of money, too. Now, go this way. There's another guy here. I think a hiker. Tries to battle us. I think you can probably skip past this guy. Well, you can skip past a lot of these people. I'm just doing it for the experience. Let's see. Oh, these are weak Pokemon. I'm just going to cut away. Alright, beat him. Now go down here. Let's see, there's a fire breather over there. Over here, there is another item. Bunch of items here. Just a potion. 
But you never know. Especially if you're a little bit underleveled here. Which you really shouldn't be. Oh, another item. Yeah, like most caves, this place has tons of items. Ooh, a great ball. Not bad. This guy's another fire breather. Gonna fight him for the experience. I'll show it if it's worthwhile. Let's see. Oh, a Zubat. Probably just gonna be some trainer with, like, a bunch of Zubat. Oh, a coughing. Eh, whatever. Well, Butterfree's confusion pretty much destroyed them. That's why it's a good idea to have one. Let's see who this is. Alright. I don't think we've seen anyone like them before. Alright, this is a Pokemaniac. They've got a Slowpoke. Uh, Slowpokes, I'm pretty sure, are part Psychic. They should be. So, yeah, Bite will destroy this thing. Oh, wow. Right, I think they have pretty good... Wait, no. Well, they probably have good defense, too. Bites... Yeah, Bite should be physical. Oh, wow, they have... Right, Growl did not help that at all. I could have totally just used Bite, but for some reason I chose Scratch. And knocked out. Wow, got a lot of money there. Definitely a battle worth going through. And that was worthless. Well, no, because it was a lot of money. Here we got an item. And here... We can leave. Here we are in Rap 33. But I think I'm going to finish off the episode right here. So, wow, sorry about that. So if you liked it, please rate, comment, subscribe, send this to your friends, and I'll see you guys next time.